Hello and welcome to this video walkthrough of the 2014 Oxford PATS exam, the physics section, brought to you by CowanPhysics.com. The physics section begins with question 10. Excluding Pluto, for the planets in our solar system, in order of increasing mean distance from the Sun, which of the following statements is or are correct? Statement 1. The duration of the day on each planet increases. Now we'll come back to that one because there is no hard and fast rule uh, that tells us exactly what the length of each day on, on, on the planet will be. The duration of the year on each planet increases. Well, well, this is certainly true because Kepler's third law tells us that the time period t squared is proportional to the distance r cubed. So as the mean distance r increases, the time period will increase. So we can tick that one. The size and the volume of the planets increases. Well, Mercury and Venus are both smaller than the Earth, so that's possibly true. But then Mars is also smaller than the Earth. And then Jupiter is the largest of all the planets before, before Saturn, which is slightly smaller. So there is no general pattern for that one. So that one is not true. The number of moons of each planet increases. Again, that's true up to a point, but there are planets further out, like Uranus and Neptune, that have fewer moons than, say, Jupiter and Saturn. So that one's not true. And the planets change from rocky to gas giants. Well, yes, if we're excluding Pluto, the inner planets from Mercury to Mars are all uh, rocky and the outer planets from Jupiter to Neptune are all gas giants. So that one is true. Now, this leaves us with a couple of options. We know that statement B is not correct. We know that statement C is not correct. And we're left with statements A and D that could possibly be correct. The duration of the day on each planet increases. Well, as I said, there's no hard and fast rule for this one, but it's worth recognising that Mercury and Venus both have days that are much, much longer uh, than that of the Earth. So that one is not true. So therefore, statement D is correct. <laughs> 